The latest news now is that Matthias Eziaku has been arrested. What happened to Matthias Eziak? Watch to the end though, because this is what a lot of people want to know, right? So according to the story, Matthias Ezako was ministering, okay? Was ministering in his church. You know, he formed a church he called Omenana Church, okay? Okay, sorry, Oka Omenana. Some men walked in, men on uniform. They walked in and they arrested this young man. They carried him away. I will play the video for you to watch the full video of how it all happened, okay? People do not really know if these people are police people or they are maybe kidnappers or something okay so this is what is currently trending matthias Ezeaku has been arrested like they carried him away i don't even know using the word arrested is even right because these people these people they were wearing police uniform but nobody could tell the people that sent them what did he do what was his offense nothing they just carried him away he was even struggling. So what do you think would be the problem? I see some content creators rejoicing that hey, they have arrested Matthias. Even some people that call themselves pastors, they are rejoicing that they have arrested Matthias. What evil is Matthias Isaiah could doing that is worth rejoicing because he has been arrested or he has been carried away by some certain people? A lot of people are speculating that he's some um, pastor that has been threatening him for a very long time. Is the people that arrested him the pastor that he's always condemning are the people that arrested him me i don't know just watch the full video tell me what you think down in the comment section who do you think they are behind his arrest do you think it is pastors his followed traditionalists or is the government that felt like arresting him for whatsoever reason i also feel like the government have no right to arrest matthias if it has to do with his religion because in Nigeria here, we have the right to to association, right? So if Mataya forms a church and give it a name and start preaching, even if whatever he's preaching does not align to what we call Christianity, it is his right, right? So I don't think it's government that came, um, that sent these people, right? I don't, I don't feel like it is government that sent these people. I feel like maybe we don't even know what to call it. I don't know. Just tell me what you think down in the comment section. I'll see you guys on my next one. Watch this video to the end. See them. Hmm. I don't do anything now. Hmm. I don't do anything now.